I have now fitted a set of genuine Land Rover injectors to this car. No more, no more Mr. Nice Guy with this now. It's uh, gloves off. One thing to notice before you know I burst into joy of excitement. This is a, a Delphi plug that we took out, one that was working. This is a Chinese one. No names, no marks. I want you to look at the, the difference. Even the little rings down here are identical. But I think there's something wrong with the nozzles. Anyway, it doesn't really matter, but what I wanted you to do was look at this here. This is Delphi one, but look at the difference in the new ones. I don't know if you can see, wait a minute, if you're still done, I might have to get this bit out a bit. Uh, here we go. See there? They're more rounder here. Let's see if it starts. So the moment of truth. What's it like? Good. Nice and, nice and responsive. I'll just turn it off. The manifold is nice and evenly hot. Those injectors are firing perfectly. Now, let me just move this camera. What a journey this has been. The original set of injectors we took down to an allegedly professional shop and told us that they were adequate to work. Well, obviously they weren't. A bit disappointed there. And uh, we were sent by Jason a set of injectors from Germany. And there was only there was two, two uh, CAV ones, Delphi CAV, and two no-name ones. And it seems to be the no-name ones weren't firing properly. So set of genuine injectors in they were very very expensive i must admit but it solved the problem so we've been through the, no we don't need that we've been through we've been through this engine we've had the head off we checked all the all the things that we thought was wrong but it just shows you when you you know you get a set of injectors and they say they're okay well they were sort of running but not properly all right, so let that be a lesson to us all. Uh, I know a lot of people say, well, you should put new injectors in the first place. Yeah, but when you get them checked out by a professional shop, you expect them to be right. You know, um, j just shows how finicky these engines can be. So, the next thing, box it up. And let's get the oils changed on it. We'll have it running for a while. And uh, put it all back together and get rid of it. Sick of looking at it. Alright, so we've made this Land Rover better. And thanks for all your support and all your comments and all your suggestions. We were all over the place on this one and, and it was, you know, so bizarrely stupid. It was, well, it was stupid. So we'll catch you in the next video. Take care now. Ta-da.